Welcome back. Dave Warren joins us once again with another look at Tropical Storm Ada this morning. Yes, we continue to look at it uh, moving over Cuba here about two hours away from the next advisory, about 12 hours away when uh, we'll see the storm getting pretty close to the area and likely seeing these tropical storm force winds extending into the Keys and maybe parts of uh, South Florida as well. Uh, there are the watches and warnings all of the peninsula here, inland tropical storm warning along the coast, a hurricane watch in effect. Storm, storm moving to the north, northeast, but turning west sharply now uh, between about uh, Sunday afternoon and Monday morning. By Monday at 1 a.m., forecast position to be in this general area, but tropical storm force conditions uh, extending well outside of that storm center. Uh, don't just look at the cone now. Uh, the cone expands by Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday as it's out over the Gulf. A uh, little uncertainty there about what it does once it passes by just to our south uh, or close to the area. Uh, tropical storm conditions moving north, and this will be 3, 4 o'clock this afternoon. Notice the wind direction doesn't change much, uh, if at all, uh, but the wind speeds will be increasing. By Sunday evening, uh, these are tropical storm force, <clears throat> excuse me, conditions, and then it passes by just to our south. We start to see that wind turning to the north just a bit uh, there to in the lower keys. So that could mean the northern side of the, the keys there seeing the storm uh, problems with that surge. Wind speeds continue overnight tonight and very early tomorrow out of the southeast uh, by Monday, but gradually diminishing throughout the day Monday and early Tuesday. Watching the radar, we have these squalls pushing through the area here. Uh, here in the lower keys, this could just slide to the north. That'll be a problem with flooding. Persistent problem with flooding here in Broward and Miami-Dade as these squalls continue to push through the area and advisory remains in effect. We'll have new information coming in throughout the morning. Stay tuned. Thanks so much, Dave. Be careful out there today, everybody.